Michael Martínez para Luis Aguirre Online directamente desde Francia. Estamos aquí en Lyon, el evento Backlash. A mi lado, parte de los campeones mundiales en pareja de SmackDown, Grayson Waller. How are you? I'm fantastic. You know, this is exactly what I want to do in France. Stand here and talk to you. What a treat. I'm here with Michael. Oh, lovely. Lovely. Yeah, uh, do you have sarcasm? Oh. Okay. Just checking. I'm just under. I, just, just I wonder. I wonder. All right. Let's talk about like. You, almost in theory, you have really similar careers. You know, like you went to NXT for one year to a couple years yeah. each. Then they see your talent, they take it to the main roster to work with the biggest names in the, in the yeah. industry. You know, like, how do you feel about it? Uh, I, I think it works well for us as a tag team that we have, we have similar mindset, we have similar goals. We're not happy to be here. I think some people get to NXT and they think they're a WWE superstar and they give up and they're happy to be down in NXT. We weren't happy to be in NXT. It's a great experience. We love being there, learning from some legends, but our goal is always to be bigger than that, and, and I think that's why we got out of there so quick and obviously showing what we can do on the main roster. Lovely. We grew up seeing these tag team titles, something really similar around the 2004. Yeah. We have more or less same age, more or less. Um, and look at you now. You're like, like, you made history in WrestleMania, and basically, like, what you can tell me about, like, you seeing these tag team titles growing up, and now, like, you have them, like, with you. Yeah, being a wrestling fan growing up, this was my tag team championship, you know, it looked like this, even the, the SmackDown ones originally, and, and I think SmackDown today has a, a, a lot of similarities to what SmackDown was, you know, in that 2002-2003 era. That tag division was stacked, you know, you had uh, so many teams who were so talented, who were super athletes, who went out and performed every night, and they were superstars, and, and I think we have a very similar tag division right now. Lovely. One last thing, you just made history in the biggest WrestleMania ever. That's everybody's opinion. Like yeah. I'm sure, like I, that's my opinion too. Yeah. You made history uh, getting those tag team titles from you. Like how, how like what achievement? How do you feel about it? Yeah, uh, it, it's obviously a very very cool thing, and I think it's something later in my career I'll look back on a little more fondly. But for myself and Austin, we're the kind of guys where, where we we want to know what's next. We don't want to just be the champion. You know, I'm not happy to just put this on my wall and be like, wow, I was a champion. We want to be great champions. We want to beat the best. We want to fight the best. And, and the work keeps going. So for some people, they, they, they would settle with that kind of moment. For us, we're, we're looking at what's next. Great. And I have seen, you know, like Scottish people, I think, or Scottish girls, like, they talk like Shrek or something like that. Yeah, but that's the least country you like. Oh, I well, what's the people you, you, you like less? Well, I, I don't know if that's the, the, the question I <laughs> specifically want to answer. But I did say that Scottish women look like Shrek. And then about 25 Scottish women complained in my DMs who looked exactly like Shrek, which proved my point. Uh, so I'm hoping maybe I haven't got to meet many of the French women yet. Uh, maybe, may, maybe I'll have positive things to say about them. Fingers crossed. All right. I'm from Latin America. I'm especially from Puerto Rico. One last yeah. message to all the fans from Latin America and Puerto Rico. Obviously, the, our Latin American fans are great. You know, we did the show in Puerto Rico last year. Obviously, they're rabid fans. And uh, just get used to this, this image because it ain't going to change. The next time we're in Puerto Rico, Grayson Waller, tag team champion. Lovely. Thank you very much for your time. Thanks.